Tim, we're back coming in hot with season five, and this is not going to be for the faint of heart. So we're talking programming. What can our listeners expect? Well, one thing I want to say very clearly, this isn't for general consumption. Our tagline is advanced education for strength coaches and trainers. If you think this is going to be a general program design podcast series, you are sorely mistaken. So this is something that you can just go, it'd be nice to pick up a routine and design this. Now, this is for people taking high level professionals and strength athletes to the epitome of performance. We're going to go deep into how do we look at objectively goal setting, right? Not just kind of like throwing wishes out there. It's what is realistic? What's realistic? How do we set timelines? How do we get into the nitty gritty on that leveraging the training inputs, whatever goal our client or athlete may have. And then we're going to go through evaluation. A lot of this is going to go through our courses that we go through already simultaneously. Level one is all about exercise selection. That's the foundation for movement screen and assessment. We want to make sure that we're deliberate with the exercise we select, not just ad hocing it or choosing an exercise before we even know what the problem is. Then we go to the next level. This is our level two, variable selection through physiological assessment. We want to look at body composition. We want to look at VO2 max. We want to look at cardiovascular fitness as a mechanism to see what that person not only can do, but what they can recover from. Then we're going to progress that through. We're just going to layer it now. Oh, now we have our foundation. We know what we want to accomplish. We know how long we need to get to accomplish it, what exercises we need, what variables we need. And we go into microcycle design, mesocycle design, how we structure both. Then we look at the next level, looking at that macro plan and then tying into what methods and protocols really fit nicely based off that goal. And then we'll final up with, we have to confirm or maybe dispute our results from post-testing and that debrief session. What can we improve upon? What well, we could be more effective with the next time if we do have another opportunity. This is going to be a masterclass on program design, not something that you're going to be able to go into this without much of a deeper understanding. If you are new to this podcast and you haven't listened to us, go back through two seasons ago. We went through what is it, all these different mechanisms to put on muscle, lose weight, improve your power, strength, all these different things to go into. That's a great prelude for this. If you are a coach that's just getting us to the first time, might be worth your time to go back through some of those old podcasts. But if you want to just get right into it, by all means, let's get it. It's going to be a really important season for our overall product and what we're trying to do as a, as a podcast itself. Yeah, so absolutely. If, if any of those topics that you were hitting on didn't make sense or went over your head, this is not going to be the season for you. No, that's why we're not top five in health and fitness, because we're not for everybody. Yeah, we know who I, we are. Yeah, coming out episode one will be tomorrow, September 3rd. We're going to go right into it setting your goals, setting timelines around those goals. All right. Hell yeah, Tim.